Redoute de Merville was built in 1760 under Louis XVI on the principle of a Barnes fortification. This defense work was intended to defend Wiesterham and Cordelville sur Orne and to block access to the Bay of the Orne during the Second Hundred Year War with the British Empire. The fort would consist out of a officer quarters, a guardhouse for 30 men, including 6 gunners for the service of a battery of two 24 pounder guns and a mortar. The fortification had to fight its fiercest battles during the Revolutionary War and the Empire Wars, and during this time it was put under heavy naval fire. The fort would be largely abandoned in 1815 but would still serve as a custom post. During the German occupation in 1940 the fort was more or less abandoned for over a century, but like many other 17th century forts on the Atlantic Wall, it would be reused by the Germans and received its fair share of new concrete upgrades. It's not known to me what happened during the Battle of Normandy and it seems that the Germans just abandoned the position. Since then the fort has been completely deserted, it was shortly used as a demining warehouse and then abandoned for 40 years until 1983. It was restored by the local government and is now an historic monument, and it's not known to me if this actually counts for the outside fortifications. Since March 7, 1992, more restoration started and the plan was to convert the fort into a museum. Also work was done to make signs outside for some more information on the site, but like I pointed out that seems to have been abandoned, but the work on the fort is still going on. But I doubt this location will ever be a complete museum, since it's just too large of an area. But maybe it will be made more accessible, 